welcome to my channel. Today I'll tell you about a particular word that is nay and me is a mortal verbs. We all know it and uh, I will discuss about the word may briefly. So let's check it out. May shows the possibilities. Okay, when you are using me, it means you are here I are showing the possibilities like May Rhea be upset with you? Go check on her. So this is a possibility that Rhea may upset, right? It's not sure that Rhea must be upset, but Rhea may upset. So here it is a present tense we are discussing and the structure first you have to use subject plus may plus vi. Vi means the base form that is a present tense of the verb. Next, you may have hurt her feelings by calling her fair. So here what, what it is like uh, here the word me. Again, you are using to express some possibilities, not the surety things. It's just the possibilities. So it's uh, in past tense and the structure is subject plus me plus have and v3. It means a past participle, third form of verb, right? The last one. The business may get shut down next year. So there is also a possibility and it's counted in the future. So this time first you have to, uh, you know, there's a possibility in the future. You have to use subject plus may plus vi that is a base form of verb and plus future time maker. Like if it's a future, you have to use the future, okay? Like the, or may get, you know, may get shut down in the next year. Second one, permission. So what it is, permission means you are asking for a permission for someone. That is, I go out with your sister, Cherry. So here you are taking a permission from that person that you want to go out with, you know, with your, or like with his sister. So here you are asking for a permission, right? Obviously, we should take permission. We are going with someone's sister, right? So in the next one, you may use my car if you want. So again, you are just giving someone permission that you can use my car if you want it, if you need it. Next, request. Me is commonly used to make a request. We all know when uh, it's written, you know, when we are entering to any restaurant or uh, any hotels, it's written, may I help you or bank? So it looks like me, I help you. So you're strongly... Uh, uh, identifies that you are making requests. May is commonly used to make a request. May I join you guys? Again, you're requesting for joining to the team. May I come with you on a trip? So again, here is the same thing. You are requesting to that person that you want to come to that trip. Next one, wishes. Me is also used to make a wish. Okay, me, God bless you. Okay, here, uh, you, you are wishing someone that all the, may God help you, it's your wish from your heart. May Almighty be with you, you are again making a wish that Almighty may be with you for all the time. May you both be always happy. This is a very common, we use it most of the times, may you both be happy always. Now, last to unsolicited advice or suggestion so may is often used to give unsolicited advice or here the speaker looks very polite well giving advices you know when you're giving someone's advice you cannot be rude you should uh, behave politely you should talk politely so let's check it out you may want to try these cheese cake these are heavenly you were just talking about cheesecake that's uh, cheesecake is really mouth-watering we should try, right? You, uh, you uh, may want to try this cheesecake. These are heavenly. So here you are giving us someone suggestions or advice. But yeah, cheesecakes are really heavenly in taste. You may want to think about their offer before leaving this job. So here, what they are saying to you, uh, you should think before once. Like you won't leave that this job, so that's fine. But before leaving, you should think. Next one, conditional se sentence. Here, may can be used in conditional sentence, okay? Like, may girl may not allow you to enter the building if you don't have the permit card. There is a conditional situation. What? You should have the permit card. Then the girl will allow. So there is chances of allowing to the building. 
that if you have that permit cut, then they can allow you. Otherwise, they cannot. There is a chance. That is a conditional situation. Next, we may have won a match if it if it had not rained. Again, there is a situation or here again, there is a condition that we may have won. It may possible we may. But due to all the rain, due to all this, you know, patchy uh, feel, we cannot able to win the match. So, obviously, may denote many a thing, possibilities, permission, request, wishes, suggestions, and conditional situations. Or may also use in conditional sentences. So, uh, if you like my channel, do like and share and subscribe my channel, follow my channel. Bye-bye. Take care.